Maybe talk. You seem like very good company. You know, one thing that we could do is go back and talk to uh, the one um, over at Divith Fear. We can talk to the one Dwemer who survived. I don't know where to begin. It is such an honor to meet you. Yeah, doesn't seem to be anything we can do with any of them. I mean, she's the one that we would need to talk to, it seems like. But she didn't want to tell us anything, so... Um, I don't think we're going to get anywhere there. Hold on, just really quickly. Let's go back. Greetings to you. To yeah, she likes us 100 out of 100, so. You might want to ask the guild stewards in Eldrun, Balmor, and Sadrith Moore instead. So I'm pretty sure we finished all of those things, so. Um, this it really is the last thing that we need to do. I'm pretty sure. Um, does this show up as a quest or no? Yeah, it does. Okay. But yeah, I think that, um, let's go to Sadrith Mora. An honor, to be sure. Let's see if any of them can tell us anything. An honor, to be sure. Oh, that's hilarious. You want to speak with me about advancement? Am I ready for the next range? R rank Archmage? He thinks that I'm talking about his advancement. That's hilarious. You honor me. Please speak. Okay. So we don't seem to have anything there. Here's what I'm going to do. We are going to make a stop at Divathir's uh, tower. Which, if you don't remember, that's this one right here. Or Tell Fear, yeah. The name of the guy is Divith Fear. Um, we're gonna go and make a stop at his tower, though. Uh oh, I think I crashed. Yep, I crashed. I don't know what happened. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, we crashed right about here. Seems like we're okay this time. I have no idea what caused the crash, but... That is okay. All right, we'll talk it to Diveth as well as go down into uh, the area and talk to the Glamour guy as well. Ooh, I wonder if he's going to get mad. I am technically... Oh, what happened? Oh, there we go. For whatever reason, my mouse started working outside of the program. Um, outside of the game. I'm technically... I stole this from him. This Kyrus that I've got. Let's see if he's going to get mad at us or not. Um, also, I think I need to rest. Gonna get mad? I, see this land suits you. I am you surprised really and a bit disappointed. I thought you were the Nerevarine. Why haven't you fulfilled the prophecies? Is something wrong? Did you do something you shouldn't? I've heard rumors that Archcanon Tholer Serioni, the High Priest of the Temple, is desperate, and that he asked that you come speak with him at the High Fane in Vivek City. 
If there is some problem, maybe you should go talk to Serioni. Actually, um, I already have. We're good on that front. Um, I have been cleared by them. Okay. Nope, doesn't look like uh, we can do anything else with him. He doesn't seem to be pissed that we're wearing his stolen property. So that's good, I guess? Let's see, it's through here. Your turn to talk. Yeah, I can't remember. I think the fastest way is to go left, but I don't know that for sure. Let's see. Is this a dead end? This is a dead end, okay. There we are. Okay. Okay, so, disappearance of the dwarfs. I cannot say what happened. I was not there to observe. I was in an outer realm at the time. And when I came back, my people were gone. I left Red Mountain wandering Tamriel for years, searching our deserted colonies, looking for a survivor or an explanation. Then, a long, long time ago, I returned to Red Mountain, still looking for answers. Instead, I found corpus disease, and I have been here ever since. I have theories, if you are interested. See, we've already gotten all this information, so... Um, but... Hmm. I don't know, man. Lord Kagernak, the foremost arcane philosopher and magecrafter of my era, devised tools to shape my mytho-poeic -po forces, intending to transcend the limits of Dwemer mortality. However, in reviewing his formulae, some logicians argue that side effects were unpredictable, and errors might be catastrophic. I think Kagernak might have succeeded in granting our race eternal life, with unforeseen consequences, such as wholesale displacement to an outer realm, or he may have erred and utterly destroyed our race. Cool. Okay. Well, that did not give us anything, so that means that I have zero leads for what we're supposed to bring to Arch Archmage Trebonius. <laughs> I mean, that's about all the information we know already, so. Jesus, 29 pages? Hmm. All right. I still kind of want to steal from you. I wonder if I can... Yeah, I can probably get away with it, honestly. First try, baby! Okay. Alright, what pieces do I actually need for the Dwemer set? I'm pretty sure I need a Curus and I think I have Greaves, but I might want to grab it just in case. I think I need both pauldrons. Well, let's just see what we can end up carrying. If I can get it all, I'll just take it all. But, you know, I probably can. I can hold 600 weight right now, so... <laughs> We'll just take the whole set. We're going to take everything except for the axe. Because I'm a monster.
Okay, we got that. Yeah, I'm a monster. So other than that quest, Mage's Guild is pretty much done. Um, I may look it up just to get a lead on what I'm supposed to do here because uh, I followed all the leads that I could. But Okay, left and right bracer. We've got the boots. We've got the helmet. So it looks like we actually only need the cuirass and the pauldrons. Okay. move those over a little bit more. Okay. So, Curus. Right pauldron. Left pauldron. And I guess we can sell the rest of this. How are we doing on Ebony? Did we end up with a... F I think we ended up with a full set because we got somebody... Let's see. Right and left pauldron. Do we have the bracers? We do have the bracers. Um, so it's only the helmet. That no, wait. No, wait, 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 wait. No, those are Inderil. No, I don't think we have the helmet. So we need an ebony helmet. If that exists. I'm assuming that it does, but... We need quite a bit for the Daedric set. Okay. Anything else I need to drop off? Should try and read all those books. I got a bunch of stuff to sell. I can sell that. And I think I can sell that. Let's go and see if I've got a Dwarven Halberd down there. If not, then I'll drop that off. Right there. Okay, so we can sell ours then. Okay, cool. I could sell these, but let's not worry about it right now since I already have a full set. Uh, the only thing that I don't have on right now is that other bracer. Um, hold up. Oh, actually. That's right, okay. So, we do need a right bracer, I think. You're, is this a left? I don't know what Wraith Guard is on right now. So... And Wraith Guard's still on, okay. So that's what happened. Gotcha. Oh, I thought that was vampire dust. I was like, that is way too low for vampire dust. Those are 500 each. cheaper ones first because we're probably going to have to rest in order to get some of this stuff in. Maybe I can get one of these. 
Boom, perfect. Don't you know it always takes like a week to sell things? Salutations. It's just like real life, right? Okay, so I think the only thing I have left is, I think I'm gonna keep those just in case I wanna use them for enchanting. Um, but this, and it might take a while for us to sell all those. Is there anything else we need to sell? Don't need any bargain. Sell the Flynn. Oh yeah, that's right. Sell that. The Jink Blade will have to go to... You know what? As a matter of fact, we're just going to go to him. Because uh, it'll he'll be the fastest way for us to sell all of those coins as well. Um, we're going to go to that scamp. Where would you like to go? And once again, I forgot that we have to get to Caldera through the Major's Guild, so... My bad. How are we doing on level up? We're getting close. Stupid fucking thing. I still hate those things. I really do. Like, it wouldn't be so bad if they showed up after your rest. Because then, then it wouldn't be so much of a pain in the ass, right? Like, that change alone would completely change my mind on them. They'd still be annoying, just not nearly as annoying as they currently are. The fact that they show up before you actually can rest is is the thing that really drives me up the wall. Hmm. 
Okay, so I'm gonna sell all of those Dwemer coins and that Jink blade. So I'll be back in a minute. All right, so you can sell exactly 100 of them to him at a time for 5,000 gold. So it only took me three days. Four if you include the Jink blade. All right, so at this point, I'm gonna figure out what I need to do in order to finish the Mage's Guild. And then at that point, we may actually just uh, finish up main story next. And then after that, we may join some other um, groups as well as after that, we'll also be doing DLC stuff. So um, we're kind of getting there, but um, there's still the Imperial Legion, the Imperial Cult and the uh, the Temple. So those three are still three of the main story ones that we need to do, as well as Twin Lamps, um, which that one is like not very long. I think that one's only a couple of missions long. Um, but other than that, based on main story, I think that we're almost through what we can do in a single playthrough. So, um, and then DLC stuff. Um, but yeah, I'll be back in just a minute after I figure out what I need to do for this Mage's Guild quest. Or at least get a lead. I'm not gonna look too far into it, just I need a lead. Alright, so as it turns out, our instincts were not half bad. So what we need are three different books. And, um, we have collected all three books at different points during the game. Uh, two of them are on display in my house currently, and the other one is one that we found recently and I sold to uh, this rare bookseller in Vivek. Um, so I had to hunt this down because uh, I knew for sure that I had this one, I just couldn't remember who I sold it to. Turns out it's this guy, so Jobasha, I am taking this back, thank you very much. Um, all right, so the Egg of Time, that's one of the books that we need. Now let's recall, um, oh, I'm in items right now. It took me a while to hunt this one down, but I got there. So the egg of time, we also need divine metaphysics and the hanging gardens book. And with those three books, we should now be able to talk to Edwina. So we were correct in that Edwina is the one to talk to. Um, we're going to read these books before we go and talk to her. Sorry, I've got <laughs> a little bit of cough. Trying to keep it under wraps. Keep it under control. Okay. Um, so yeah, let's go to Edwina in Vivek. And uh, we'll read these books. Took me a while to hunt down that book, but I didn't want to have to use a console command, so. Would have been faster, would have been easier, but I was like, I know I got this. Let's go and find it. Do it the proper way. Oh, greetings. How do you do? <laughs> All right, Vivek, here we come. You seem like very good company. All right, Divine Metaphysics. I don't think there's going to be much to read here. Yep. Let's see. Hanging Gardens, that's the one we're actually going to have to read. I think these other two, yep, are all in Dwemer. This was written in Dwemer and translated to Aldmeris. Only fragments of the Aldmeris are readable, but it may be enough for a scholar of Aldmeris to translate fragments of other Dwemer books. Um, okay, so we actually have read this. Oh, yeah, I read this somewhat recently, so I'm not going to end up reading this again. Um, it's only these two pages, and it only gives us little pieces of this, so um, that's what we've got. Um, and now, uh, if we bring this to Edwina, we should be able to uh, get a little bit more An out honor, of her. honor, to be sure. Such useless creatures. Well, that was rude. You talking about me? Um, okay, um, I don't know how to... Trigger this. Huh. I've got the books. I feel like we might be hitting some kind of bug here. She's probably the one that we need to get to trigger something, but this is not. Hmm. Oh, greetings. How do you do? Yeah, I'm missing something. 
We need to trigger something before we're able... Oh, no, you're not who we're supposed to talk to. Um, who are we supposed to talk to? Just a minute. Uh, Edwina is not you. Oh, greetings. Who is How Edwina? Do do? Maybe talk. With pleasure. Please, go ahead. I'm all... I'd be happy to talk. I'd be My happy Edwina. to talk. My pleasure. Um, she's... The leader of one of the other guilds, right? Was it you? I think it's you. Right? Are you? Yeah, you're Edwina. I find you most interesting right now. Please go ahead. Okay. Okay. It looks like uh, maybe I just talked to you about each of these individual books. Okay, Divine Metaphysics. I cannot make sense of this. Even when I try using the Hanging Gardens you found as a translation key, the words simply do not make any sense. I am certain the author did not know any magic himself. Yes, these are probably just the ramblings of some dwarven lunatic. Okay. Egg of Time. This book is puzzling to me. You might want to ask Hasfat Antibalus in Balmora. Okay. Now this is an interesting book, Analog. It appears to be written in both Dwemer and Aldmeris. If you could find a scholar of the Dwemer who knew Aldmeris, you might be able to translate portions of the Dwemer text. This book is priceless in the right hands. Okay. So... Do we, do we know anybody who can read Aldmeris? All right, let's follow our lead. We have one lead. Um, let's see. Well, which one was it? Egg of Time. Asfat Antibolus and Balmora. I find myself in pleasant company. Please share your thoughts. Warm greetings, Outland. I don't know where to begin. It is such an honor to meet you. Hmm. We are blessed, truly blessed. I feel like I know that name, I just don't know where Asfat is. You're in good company, friends. Clearly not here. Well, I find myself in pleasant company. Please share your thoughts. Okay, that's why I know the name. Asfat is the guy that we got that Dwemer uh, puzzle box for. I don't so he's in the Fighters Guild. With pleasure. Please, knew I knew that ahead. name. I'm all ears. Okay. I can make out some of what Divine Metaphysics is saying. It seems to suggest that the new gods may be created through some kind of sorcery. I do not know much of magic. Perhaps you should speak with someone who is both a wizard and a scholar? With the Hanging Gardens book as a key. Okay, cool. Those are basically the same. Um, and can you tell me anything about Egg of Time? It's certainly very suggestive. I fear I'm not quite able to piece together what is going on. You might want to take these books to another Dwemer scholar. Perhaps one of the older Telvanni. Okay, now that's an idea. Um, let's see. Do we know of one of the Telvanni that can read Dwemer? Hmm. Maybe, um, the lady... I'm thinking maybe the lady who helped us build our um, tower. I wonder if she's the one we're supposed to go and talk to. Um, let's try her first. I'm trying to remember. I'm also thinking maybe Divith. I'm thinking it's probably one of those two. Yeah. All right, say, since I we're going to Sage with Mora, right let's here. try that first. Mara's mercy on you.
these getting updates? No, not really. Please be the person. Please blessed. be the person. I don't know where to begin. It is such an honor to meet you. Okay, nothing for egg of time. Darn, it's not you. Okay. Um, on our way up, let's talk to some of the people that were down there, see if we can get a lead. If not, I'm gonna look it up. That way I don't tra travel all the way to Diveth and have it not be him. Forget tomorrow. If you are I don't think it's gonna be anybody in the temple, but it might be one of the people up through this next area. If I had a better memory, man. Like, I, we probably have all the information we need to figure out who it is. I just don't remember. I just don't remember who can read Aldmeri. I'd serve you humbly, Master. Whatever your desire. Okay. Probably one of the counselors, but I'm just going to look this up. We are blessed. Truly blessed. Yep, just like I feared. It was it was definitely somebody I should have known. Um, all right, we're going to head to Nisus. To Arv's Drellin. Remember that guy that we got to join the Telvani uh, counselors? Blessed. It's him. Um, it's probably fastest for me to recall. Okay, so we need to head north, so Aldrune, and then we can probably hit Nisus from there. We make a special trip just for you. So yeah, if you have a better memory than I do, you can probably do all this stuff yourself. And as long as you're keeping those uh, Dwemer books as you go through the stories, um, yeah, you should be able to figure this out yourself, you know, but... Clearly, my memory isn't so good, but... Okay. Egg of Time. Yes, I can now translate these books. The first one is Thuand. Zanch's re refutation of a popular theory from Nerevar's time. A few tones of Dwemer believed that using the power of Lorcan's heart was an unjustifiable risk. The Egg of Time contains Thuan's arguments against this idea, many of which are quite compelling. The next book, Divine Metaphysics, is an explanation of how the Dwemer tried to make a new god. Anumidium, using Kaganok's tools and the sacred tones of Lorcan's heart. Okay, cool. Okay, adapted to the meanness of intellects. Translated, okay, seems to be a treatise explaining how to create a new god through sorcery. The Egg of Time seems to be a refutation of the idea that linking to a divine source of power can be dangerous. Um, Egg of Time refutes this idea. Perhaps the author was wrong, and this is what happened to the dwarves. Okay. 
Um, and now, um, let's see. I'm just going to follow the guide because I'm sick of, you know, futzing about. Um, so technically right now it sounds like we can return to Trebonius, Trebonius, um, but there are some optional steps to tick to speak to Divith Fear and Yagram Bagarn, which is the dwarf guy. So now that we have the translation, I mean, technically we might already have that information. Um, we may not have to actually do this. Okay, by the sounds of it, um, there's no reason for us to go back. We're just going to get the same information. Um, we've already gotten all the information that we can. Which, surpri like, it surprises me that since we've already talked to Yagram, that that wasn't enough to complete the quest, because it's still a little bit, like... Obtuse? Uh, up in the air, I guess. Um, but it's fine. I mean, we didn't really learn any new information. We already had the information that we got from the translations of the books, but um, we still needed to translate the books to complete this quest. So um, we're just going to go back to Trebonius now. Oh, um, just know that in your playthrough, if you haven't already, you can go back and talk to Divith Fear, who will tell you to, you know, basically go and find Yagram, who is the dwarf. And if you talk to the dwarf and get that information, that's also optional stuff that you can do, um, which we've already done. So, um, okay. I'd be happy to talk. My pleasure, really. All right, Trebonius. Oh, let me see those books, Archmage. Oh yes, of course. This egg of time is quite obvious in its um, uh, descriptions of the things that happened. Yes, of course, it is all quite clear to me. I would prefer that you wrote a report that um. Uh, simplified your findings, but I trust that you have indeed solved the mystery. I have. I have indeed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, you solved our little dwarven mystery quite easily, I'm sure. Uh, once these recent troubles have passed, I may have more duties for you. Is that implying that after we complete the story, there will be very more? Good company. Yeah, I don't know about that. Okay. At any rate, we completed it, so <laughs> there we go. All right, so technically I think there are more things that we can do with the Fighters Guild, but like I said, I think at this point we're going to start going down main story stuff again. Um, so, let's see. Uh, with that information, let's go ahead and see what we've got here. What is this? Yeah, we could kill him, but we're not going to worry about that right now. All right, well, there doesn't seem to be a clear path forward. But we kind of know what we need to do anyway. Um, what we need to do is we need to uh, find, uh, what are they called? Something in Keening. So basically, let's see. We need to find, it's probably these, honestly. Odrosal and Vemnal. That's probably where Keening and whatever that other divine item is that we need to find in order to go after Dagathur. So it seems like we're going to be heading towards Ghostgate and uh, trying to do that. So, cool stuff. So, let's get prepped. I don't think there's too much we really need to do to prep for this. Let's drop off our books. Perfect. Perfectly stacked books. Oh yeah, I need to sell those. Drop those off. Are those fitting here? I don't think so. I think this was full, wasn't it? Nope, not quite. Ah, 
God, I hate that. All right, so I need to sell a couple of things like this battle axe and uh, whatnot. And uh, then we're going to head there. Um, let's see. So let's go ahead and mark right here. Right now our mark is outside, so. Doing fine on arrows. Might be a while before we come back, so let's take three more of these. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we're good. All right, I think Aldrune is probably the closest place for us to get to Ghost Gate. And when we get to Ghost Gate, I think I'll read those uh, those things that we got from uh, Vivek. Because those are technically our instructions going forward, so um, yeah. mountain. There's still battle music, so I was looking for, see if there was another cliff razor chilling somewhere. Now, technically, we can fly over this with levitate. But uh, I kind of want to go and talk to a bunch of people in the Ghost Gate area again. See if they have anything interesting to say to us as we uh, have, you know, basically been named Nerevarine or anything like that. There could be something interesting, I don't know. save and let's start going through this so Dagathur's plans the following documents were prepared by temple scholars and agents of the Inquisition uh, uh, for Lord Vivek I'd like to give a very special shout out to my patron supporters Darren York ZTD seventh son Ivan K Len knife namase Kyle the Monarch, and Jordan and Emily Hill. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.